Ah, me ki koe nei, ahi ki me nui māku me taku whānau, koe nei pia te ki mūwhakamutunga mō ki i roto i tēnei poraka, no reira, me he wiki nui, he wiki tino whakahirahira mō ku. Yeah, I guess it's going to be a pretty special occasion on Saturday, not only for myself, but for the whole team and I guess for all cultures that are going to be there on Saturday. So, yeah, I'm really looking forward to it. It's been a good week here in Auckland, so... Yeah, we're all looking forward to it. Yeah, obviously it's been huge for the Māoris and um, uh, for me, I think um, my focus is just playing good footy, um, wherever that is, if it's Targo or the Hondas. Um, and if I'm here next year uh, in the 10 jersey, then um, yeah, that'll be my focus at that time. But just for now, I'll just be focusing on trying to play some good footy and whatever happens, happens. Yeah, me ki tōna wā pea ka hoki mai ngari Kara i te tino me ki tiro ki ngā tau e hare mai ana e aroa nga au ki tēnei ki mea te rāhorui ka tahi ka hare ki tā wahi mo te rua tau mā reira ka ahua whakaaro ka whakawhiti kōrero me te whānau me wetla i atu tangata anō hoki Yeah, rugby is a funny sport isn't it? You can sort of end up at one place one minute and you could be on the other side of the world so yeah, I wouldn't say this will be the end for me in New Zealand you never know where things will, will take uh, myself and my family, but um, yeah, I guess I'm sort of treating it as probably my last game in the Māori All Black jersey, but um, you never know. Yeah, it's cool. Um, yeah, obviously, half Samoan, half Māori. Um, real proud to represent my uh, my mum's side, on my Māori side, uh, from Ngāpoi to Rāru up, up north. So that's no, proud and um, obviously played um, for the Samoan 20s. So, you know, it's real interesting. Uh, last week when you know they were doing the Siva and you know I guess it's a special moment yeah. I think it's been an awesome change for me uh, you know I didn't really get a crack over the last three years and then um, this this year alone I've probably played the same amount of games over that three year span so just having that game time is massive um, and it's you know worked wonders for me so I've been loving my time down there. <laughs> Uh, you know, right, uh, he, he can be new, get the idea. Um, yeah, rugby league's probably my favourite sport, to be honest. I really enjoy it. <laughs> I watch it probably more than anything else. So I'm really looking forward to tomorrow captain's run just to be on Mount Smart. And um, I'm a big Warriors supporter, so I'm looking forward to, to heading down there. But um, yeah, I just like my rugby league in general. So I'm really looking forward to, I guess, playing on a, on a rugby league field. It'll be a bit different, but um, yeah, can't wait. Cool. So you're going to be channeling your inner Sean Johnson? Oh, I hope so. Um, I'm pretty excited for him coming back, but yeah, I guess it's, um, I actually was talking to one of the boys earlier in the week and he was saying um, a couple of things around some of the rugby league strategies, but <laughs> being just being able to play on Mount Smart, but yeah, I'm just looking forward to not only our game, but I think the game, the whole Saturday in general will be a massive occasion for all cultures, especially here in Auckland. Um, it's got such a strong Pacifica and Māori culture um, throughout the whole city, so hopefully they can all turn up. No, I've actually never been to Mount Smart, so it'll be a new experience for me, so that'll be something cool. Um, hopefully we can uh, channel our inner warriors razzle out there, so hopefully it's a bit drier as well this week, so we can actually um, play our style of rugby and um, just let everyone have a crack at their own game.